yo what is up guys welcome back to a new video and into this video we're gonna um do some updates on my last video i'm actually so glad for you guys for almost 1000 views and 36 likes on the video so today is gonna be a better version of the settings that i use i'm gonna be showing you the fast flags i'm gonna be showing you my custom cursor even though i'm having it normal now um i'm gonna have some links it's gonna be amazing <laughs> anyways let's start the video make sure to just share it to your friends like and sub it really helps me since i'm yeah um and yeah let's go so as you can see my roblox is literally normal everything is normal um so what we're gonna do first is you're gonna just leave roblox all right go to your desktop and close roblox um all right so first of all let's get the fast flags what are you gonna do you're gonna press windows r and then you're gonna see this you're gonna type this i'm gonna leave it in the description as well as the other links or you could just check in my discord server i literally just put them right now so you're gonna paste this and then press ok you're gonna see this one oh my god it's ixp settings it's not okay um get it to the right and then drag it outside right click properties make sure it's off okay and holy that's so much okay just delete and then get your fast flags i'm gonna use mine link in the description also for my uh, discord server and also if i change just remind me to change it because oh we got a new member anyways um so you're gonna get these all right and then paste it here you're gonna check if you need anything on uh, sky gray yeah dimness of particles uh, display fps let me just show my fps and yeah um i'm gonna tell you the fixes later so you're gonna control s and control w and then right click properties make sure it's on again because if you didn't enable it the read only it's gonna change it so we're gonna close and then now for the custom cursor and for the dark textures and the dark sky so i have the links in the description uh custom sky you can download it shout out to devi mn2 and dark textures um also this one you're gonna download them and then you're gonna just um drag them but I downloaded them before in this folder so I'm gonna drag them outside let's say you download the dark textures and the Roblox custom sky and yeah I'm gonna just leave this let me get these here um yeah I'm I have ADC anyways uh you're gonna right click on Roblox um open file location all right and then drag it to the anywhere anywhere literally anywhere and then uh get your folders you're gonna open this right and then um open this one as well and put it up to the right um bleh. so we have here the dark textures and we're gonna get here the uh roblox you're gonna start with the dark textures so what you're gonna do platform content pc textures and then you're gonna remove everything here copy it and paste it here boom you just got the dark textures now we're gonna close this and get the roblox customs guys i don't know why is it not pre pre anyways so you can see um we have some um folders here we i'm gonna use for example uh, overcast overcast um you can check even the 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 stuff here it looks cool you're gonna select them and copy and then you're gonna go to sky and paste it here and yeah you just got the, the custom sky and for the last thing which is you're gonna let's just um let me just leave this like that i'm gonna drag it to the right so i know what i'm doing um you're gonna just um go here yeah i have my cursors in a folder but you could just go to my uh, discord also i have some cursors i'm gonna upload more um so you, i'm gonna for example choose my number two this is my like my favorite so oh not not you not right now bro um yeah well i think i close roblox so you're gonna just open file location again um then here go to content textures cursors keyboard mouse and then place it here and that's it and if you want to be like a nerd and you want to have the shift lock also you're gonna go mouse lock cursor and make sure it's before you click the cursors and just paste it here and there it just replace it literally that's it you literally just customized it in almost um where five minutes let's now go and test it as you can see when i popped it it just went here and yeah as you can see the dark sky um we have everything here you guys just lower my yeah everything is working um if you noticed here you're gonna it's darker when it's here and i'm gonna show you when it's inside as you can see 
texture is normal but when you make it on a higher level of textures you're gonna see it better you are gonna see that it's dark now everything is dark if you made it on level 10 it's better but for your graphics just don't and i'm cooked so yeah um for the feedback some people have told me that the the hiding gui it's not actually working as i'm doing it right now um so what you're gonna do let me just open you're gonna open this again the run command you're gonna see it saved you're gonna drag the ixp settings outside and then uh properties cancel it apply okay and then go here and then let's go to your browser so let's say for example you're not in my group or you're not like you just join the group and it's not working what are you gonna do you're gonna just <coughs> check any old group that you have for example um jd or kim whatever you're gonna go to the link copy this id and then copy it and paste it um here and this but uh since it's working for me i don't need i'm just gonna use it for my group and then you're gonna control s and w as well and then you're gonna right click again properties read only apply okay and then get it back and that's it yeah um it's gonna work for you but well yeah it's gonna work for you anyways thank you so much guys for watching i hope you liked the tutorial and if you need anything just dm me on discord or even type in the comment sections it really helps and like and subscribe buddy and yeah um well, well um bro this is this is so awkward